The alphabet series. B for the bees buzzing around and beluga whales. B for the bananas that we love to eat and the basketball bouncing around. B for beluga whale. The beluga or white whale is one of the smallest species of whale. Their distinctive color and prominent foreheads make them easily identifiable. Unlike most other whales, the beluga has a very flexible neck that enables it to nod and turn its head in all directions. Belugas generally live together in small groups known as pods. They are social animals and vocal communicators using a diversified language of clicks, whistles, and clangs. Belugas can also copy a variety of other sounds. B for bees. Honey bees communicate through a dance called the waggle dance. Bees have the proud title of being the only insect that makes food which humans can eat. A bee has five eyes. A hive of bees can create 45 kilograms of honey in a year. Bees beat their wings 11,400 times in a minute. B for bananas. Bananas grow in large hanging bunches called hands. Bananas contain around 75% water. Humans share 50% of our DNA with bananas. Over 100 billion bananas are eaten every year in the world, making them the fourth most popular agricultural product. B for basketball. Basketball was invented in 1891 by James Naismith. The first basketball game in Europe was arranged by Mel Rideout in Paris. Until 1929, there wasn't a hole in the basket to let the ball pass through. The first hoops were just peach baskets and the first backboards were made of wire. B for bear. Bears live in various types of habitat, like hardwood forests, dense swamps, and forested wetlands. Black bears are omnivores. They eat plants like scum cabbage, grasses, berries, acorns, and nuts. They also eat bees, ants, termites, a variety of small to medium-sized animals, and dead animals. B for baboon. A baboon's tail is usually about 16 to 28 inches, 41 to 71 centimeters long. Adult males are about twice the size of adult females. Baboons can be different colors, including ash gray, reddish brown, olive brown, and yellow green. No matter what the color is, however, a baboon's fur is always rough. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed exploring the brilliant bees with me. Stay tuned for Charming Seas with me. Please like, share, and subscribe for more videos.